Getting started with Yandex Metrica. Step four, a quick guide to the user interface. Now that you have a Yandex Metrica tag and have set up goals for your site, your reports will be filling up with important data about your website. But how do you make sense of all these numbers? In this video, we will show you around Yandex Metrica's interface and teach you how to get answers to some basic questions about how your site is doing. Let's start by looking at the most important elements of a Yandex Metrica report. Rows of a report are called dimensions. In them, you will see sessions. Sessions are visits to your site. In a dimension, sessions are grouped together according to a common characteristic. For instance, here we can see all sessions from search engines, all sessions generated by paid ads, and so on. In the columns of the report, we see the different metrics calculated for those dimensions, while here we see the number of sessions from search engines, the number of users who created those sessions, how many pages they viewed, and other data. By default, the tree view allows you to drill down into the specifics of each dimension. For example, it will let you see how your ad traffic is distributed between certain ad campaigns, banners, and even keywords. By switching to the list view, you can instantly see the best performing campaigns, banners, and keywords. Check the box next to a dimension to display it on the graph above the report. You can switch graph types to display your data in different ways. Be sure to choose what time period you want to see for your data. In this example, we are looking at all sessions from search engines that happened in January 2017. A lot of different reports are available in Yandex Metrica. Every report is there to answer a particular set of questions. The Sources report tells you which sources drove users to your site, be it search, advertising, an email campaign, or through a link posted on a certain site. A Traffic report shows you how many sessions have occurred on your site. The Geography report shows you which regions your users came from while the technology report tells you what they are using, such as their device type, mobile device brand, the operating system version, and much more. The set of dimensions and the metrics that you see for them when you open a report is not fixed. You can add and remove almost any dimensions and metrics to any report to completely customize it to your needs. For example, you can add the country and city dimensions to learn where the most traffic from each source is coming from. You can regroup dimensions to see your data in a different way, such as to learn how traffic sources are distributed by country. You can also add new metrics to learn something else about the sessions from different regions and traffic sources, such as the percentage of sessions that came from a mobile device. Of course, you can add goals to your reports, as well as various metrics that are calculated for a specific goal. For example, you can find out the number of users that have reached a particular goal in a certain group of sessions. This might be all sessions where all users came to the site from search. Give your custom report a name and save it to quickly access it. You can also bookmark your most frequently used reports, both for default and custom reports. You don't have to always access the interface either to get reports. Instead, you can schedule reports to be delivered right to your inbox. You now have a basic understanding of both the Yandex Metrica interface and the data that reports provide. Detailed information on the more advanced features can be found online in Yandex Metrica's help section.